Right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create this text flicker animation inside DaVinci Resolve. Now it's quite simple. Go to the titles and search for title plus, drag it onto the timeline and just change your text inside the text field over here. So I'm just going to write flicker. I'm going to increase the size and in the text field, I'm going to right click and click on follower. Now the follower cannot be accessed within the edit page. So you have to go to fusion page to access the follower modifier and on the top right you can see the modifiers tab is enabled so just give it a click and double click on the follower one and we want to increase the delay amount to 1 or 1.2 and set the order to random but one by one then we're going to go to shading and uh, we want to animate the opacity so create a keyframe on the opacity so just before you do that make sure your playhead is at the very first frame so once that's done then on the opacity you can create a keyframe by clicking on this diamond icon and it'll turn red that means you have created the keyframe now i'm just going to move to the fourth frame in my video and reduce the opacity down to zero go to eighth frame and increase that to some other random value go to 12 and uh, just repeat the process and keep randomizing it so i'm just going to increase and decrease it and um, keep it something like that so now if you play your animation you can see we have this flickering text animation but it will stop after some time and in order to fix that we'll go to spline and uh, make sure you select the opacity and then also click on this uh, zoom to fit icon so just give it a click and then um, make sure you select all of your keyframes so i'm just going to select these keyframes and then i'm going to click on this icon that says set loop so just click on that and it will basically loop your animation and you'll have this flickering text effect for the entire length of your fusion clip there is another way of doing this with an expression so let me just show you how to do that right click on the opacity and we guys we're just going to remove the follower from it and make sure it's set to the default value which is one i'm just going to create a keyframe there just again click on this diamond icon now i have this expression over here so let me just uh, get it i'm just going to copy it and i'm going to just paste it over here All right so once you paste it and click on enter and you can see that you will have this text flickering animation going on inside your animation and this is more organic and it will be completely random if you want to be a bit more fast you can change it from six to four or three and click on enter and the flickering will be much more quicker so that's just about it uh, you can go back to your edit page and you'll have your flickering in your animation so that's it don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe to this channel thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one